Okay, so we decided to remove all the door panels because we had nothing uh, better going on and we're just gonna yeah <laughs> we're just gonna lubricate everything uh behind the door panel so uh window regulators door lock assemblies and things like that and probably the door stops as well so we're currently taking everything off and actually these uh uh windows are all manual which is pretty cool it's a 1990 jetta so that's i got all the supplies tools and you know hazmat all that stuff and uh, uh i think you're gonna have to uh, remove this trim right here or at least uh, something with a door handle before you pop the panel off but anyways other than that what we did yesterday is uh, we replaced this door handle because this was broken so we did that and then uh we also realized that you know he can't lock his car or unlock it with the key because the key uh, is not working on these door locks because somebody apparently replaced it with a you know there somebody replaced the ignition tumbler before and uh, uh, it has a different tumbler um, uh, on this car right now and the key that this car came with doesn't work on these uh, lock lock so he will just have to go to the dealership and uh, order a new lock or the key actually um, and he's also due for some new tires which we will be uh, replacing as well um, probably maybe this or next week um, yeah so always busy always doing lots of things yeah and we also need to figure out this trunk lock uh, because we open the trunk every time with uh, this string all right so we'll have to figure that out as well and uh what else um he also had a uh, got this kit for his engine because he will be rebuilding his engine it has all new gaskets and head gasket and all the other seals for it so pretty small kit for a little engine No, uh, so do you know if it has clips or it has hooks? There's clips down here. Okay, so try to pop the clips. You just gotta pull towards you. Uh, there's no more bolts there, right? Okay, hold on, stop, stop, stop. Okay, so all, everything is out, looks like. Now you should be able to just lift it up. Try to just lift it up now. Lift it like right here. Yeah. You might have to wiggle it when you while you're lifting it up. Don't pull towards you too much. No, 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 no. Yeah. Uh, unless maybe this has to come off, off. maybe. It looks like it's it part should of be. It. It's part of it, I think. Yeah. Yeah, it should just come off. Let's see. Hold on. Uh, so what you need to do is you need to clear this handle. So hold it like about here, and then try to wiggle it off. Might be a tight fit just because it was on here for a long time. Yeah, what sucks is that I really don't want to pull these clips because they might break. Yeah, they don't look very strong. But what I would do is... Just cut a hole right here. No, I would just peel it around these clips. So instead of just pulling the clips, just peel around. The, and then you'll be able to just glue it all back later. Alright, we peeled this. We worked around these clips. And right now, we're just going to peel it up a little more, just a little bit. Go ahead on that. Actually, no, that should be enough. I'm just going to peel my side a little more. Okay. And now, uh, we'll, be, we'll be able to just uh, move the window up and down and get to all the moving parts of it and get all that lubricated. All right, so we have this film taped up for now and then we're gonna show you how uh, difficult it is to move this uh, window 
Okay, and this has never been removed or looped up or anything. Okay. And now we have a good access to the backside where we can actually lubricate the cable and this mechanism and things like that. Another good thing would be to just uh, lubricate the tracks themselves. Um, and yeah, we'll do that. We'll clean out all the channels from all the junk and we'll see how it's gonna be afterwards. Should be nice and smooth. All right, so she's he's uh, gonna finish lubricating this window and we'll recheck the operation of it. Feels nice. <laughs> How does it feel now? Is it a little better? I mean, you're going down to same. Going okay. Up, it's a lot better. Okay, going up is a lot better. Good. So then we also have to put some lube on those channels as well, both sides. Whether you want to use the automatic trans fluid or grease, it's up to you. The grease will take longer, but it will last a lot longer though. Okay, just put some ATF right there and it's actually moving really nice. Up and down really fast, amazing. Let me know what you think. Go try it out. Wow. It's a lot easier. See? So that's why lubricating the channels themselves is also an important uh, step. Spraying fluid film so it's gonna stay there a lot longer and lubricate the windows as well. Less friction. But uh, I don't want to get on the carpet. Ah, good call. On my beautiful uh, crosshatch carpet. Volkswagen Jetta. I don't remember, it was a while ago. <laughs> when I got my coat, bro. Yeah. 89 euros. Crazy like that. See what I'm doing? Do you want the smaller one? Try the smaller one. You can do it, Nathan. There's a right angle one that I have in there. What's in that mysterious orange bottle? I think it's a vodka. <laughs> but it's just. <laughs> Let's see what face he makes. Damn. Okay, it's not vodka. <laughs> How do you know? Maybe he's just like. Maybe, maybe just he's really good. good at exaggerating, you know? <laughs> so he's crying on the inside if it's vodka. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, bro. <laughs> I'm used to it every morning. See what you need where it is. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Unless your engine block cracks. <laughs> ah, why are you dropping things, Nathan? Unacceptable. Unacceptable. <laughs> you gotta flail your arms when you say it. <laughs> um, just remove these first. This and this. Get the small screwdriver. It's right there. Oh. Strong, strong man. Oh, so yeah. Wow, you making me do all the work now? It's almost like hey, I, I did the hard work by lo <laughs> of loosening this thing. Now you just gotta undo it all the way. There you go. See how easy that was? Okay. Dude, working with this old plastic yeah. is uh, scary because you never know. If yeah, you're... that's why you have to take your time. I take your time. The time to take. The, yeah, there's also a washer over there. Mm -hmm. No deposition, hold on, not the position of that. Okay, looks like that. I think so. Mm -hmm. no. This, leave that alone for right now, don't take that out. Once you remove the door panel, you'll just disconnect the connector on the back. And then undo this one. Should be. 
the you gotta side. push that okay. way. There you go. That was so much easier when we first yeah. tried to figure it out. I'll pry, pry all the clips now. We'll figure that out. That's from some wiring. It's okay. All right, and now. You did this really slowly, didn't you? Too. Slowly. Yeah, I did. I took my You're time. Up, right? Yeah, I just gotta wiggle. Just be careful. Hold on, no, 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 no. Some cracking noises. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, why don't you lower this window all the way down the same way we did on that side? Off. Oh, yeah. Come on. So I'm trying to pull it up from underneath with this hook just to kind of free it up a bit. This one is a tough one just because mainly it's already like a little broken from previous owners. Sometimes just uh, one door panel removal can take up to an hour. Unless you want to buy another door panel, which is hard to find. Let's see if you have anything helpful in this toolkit from O'Reilly for a hundred dollars. Hundred dollar toolkit.
we have this electric mirror. We're going to disconnect the connector and the speaker right there. Connect the Everything is good over the door panel. That's all good, intact, no issues. It's just you have to take your time removing this thing. And then before you reinstall it, I recommend putting grease on this lip right here. As you can see, somebody's been here before, but it was like I said, it was probably 20 years ago. Um, I don't know, was the duct tape for sale 20 years ago? <laughs> probably, it probably was, but long story short, you wanna put a lot of grease before you reinstall this door panel. That way in the future, you can easily take it off without much effort all right cool stuff all right nathan it's your job now go